No Crystal Stair, a documentary novel of the life and work of Louis Michaud, Harlem bookseller, by Vonda Michaud Nelson, is a unique work of historical fiction that sheds light on the life and legacy of Louis Michaud, one of Harlem's most prominent booksellers during the civil rights era. Through a combination of fictionalized narrative, primary source documents, and historical photographs, Nelson presents a vivid portrait of Michaud and the Harlem community he served. At its core, No Crystal Stare is a tribute to Michaud's unwavering commitment to education, activism, and community building. Born in 1895, Michaud was the son of sharecroppers who moved to Harlem during the Great Migration. Over the course of his life, he built the National Memorial African Bookstore into a cultural institution, hosting prominent authors and activists such as Malcolm X, Langston Hughes, and Muhammad Ali. One of the most striking elements of Nelson's novel is its use of a variety of narrative forms to tell Michaud's story. The novel is structured as a series of documents and interviews, including newspaper clippings, photographs, and transcripts of conversations between Michaud and his customers. This approach creates a sense of immediacy and authenticity that draws the reader into Michaud's world. One particularly effective technique is the use of Michaud's own words to narrate his life story. Throughout the novel, Nelson quotes from Michaud's speeches, interviews, and other writings, allowing his voice to come through loud and clear. This not only provides insight into Michaud's personality and beliefs but also creates a powerful sense of continuity between the past and present. As Michaud himself once said, my motto is to know where you come from so you can move on to where you're going. Another strength of No Crystal Stare is its portrayal of the complex social and political forces that shaped Michaud's life and work. The novel offers a nuanced perspective on issues such as racism, segregation, and economic inequality, showing how these factors affected Michaud and the Harlem community. For example, Nelson describes how Michaud was inspired to open his bookstore after encountering white supremacists who were distributing hate literature in Harlem. She also explores how Michaud's activism evolved over time, as he became increasingly involved in the struggle for civil rights. In addition to its historical and political themes, No Crystal Stare is also a deeply personal story of one man's struggle to make a difference in his community. Michaud is portrayed as a complex and sometimes contradictory figure with flaws and weaknesses that make him all the more human. His relationships with his family, friends, and customers are depicted with warmth and humor, providing a counterpoint to the more serious themes of the novel. Overall, No Crystal Stare is a powerful and moving work of historical fiction that offers a window into the world of Harlem during the civil rights era. Nelson's use of multiple narrative forms, historical documents, and Michaud's own words creates a rich and multifaceted portrait of a remarkable man and his times. The novel is a testament to the power of education, activism, and community building, and a reminder that the struggles of the past continue to shape the present. As Michaud himself once said, Freedom is a hard-bought thing. No crystal stare is a testament to that truth.